It's a secret, don't tell anybody, it says right on the package. Super secret. What is going on guys? My name is Sarah and I hope each and every one of you is having a beautiful day. Thank you so much for joining me for another video. But don't tell anybody, shh, it's a secret. A mega secret, a super secret. Super secret chamois cream by Hello Blue CBD. It's a secret, don't tell anybody, it says right on the package. Super secret. I'm an idiot. It's okay, I've acknowledged it. It's, it's fine, right? I hope. Anyways, I'm going to be doing a first impressions and review of this chamois cream infused with non-THC CBD. Thank you very much. I will not be getting high off my chamois cream because that would be really weird but I'm gonna let you know what I think about it. I'm kind of picky about my chamois cream. While I don't really suffer from saddle sores, thank God, knock on whatever pieces of wood I've got in this apartment, but uh, you know, just long rides, indoor trainer rides, I do really like using chamois cream. It's way better with it than without for my personal uses. And uh, there's only a few brands that I like, so I figured I'd give this one a try. It's supposed to have the benefits of being able to help with sensitive skin, to promote healing because of the CBD infusion inside the chamois cream. So it's it's supposed to be pretty good. Just as a disclaimer, I haven't been sent this product. I purchased this with my own money. This is not sponsored. I haven't been asked to make this video. This is just something I'm trying out. Figured I'd do it on camera. Share it with some like-minded endurance athletes out there who might be in the market for looking for something a little bit different. So I'm gonna try this out today. I'm gonna open this guy up. And uh, kind of looks gross, actually. It looks a little bit like mayonnaise. Doesn't smell like mayonnaise, thank God for that. Uh, it smells menthol-y, so there's definitely some menthol. I've used the Asos chamois cream, it smells a lot like that with the menthol infusion, so uh, it's gonna feel a little bit tingly. It's gonna have some numbing effect to it with that menthol in there that I knew when I purchased it. If you don't like that type of thing, you definitely aren't going to want this. Um, let's give this a quick try, okay. Hmm. So this is not like a cream, so this isn't like a chamois butter, like a, a real thin, creamy, uh, substance. This is more, this has more body to it. It's almost more like a combination of like a gel and a paste. So it'll go on very similarly to the Asos cream. Uh, I would say the Asos is a little bit firmer than this is, but uh, this is, it's similar. It's like between a cream and the Asos kind of paste. I mean, that's kind of a weird word, paste. I don't know if that's really, don't eat the paste. That's for damn sure. That's gross. It's bad for you. Don't eat paste. But at any rate, I'm going to give this a try. I'm going to get on the indoor trainer and do a bit of a ride on Zwift. And I'll give you some feedback and thoughts on the application and sensation, which is really inappropriate for YouTube. But it's chamois cream. Don't get weird. Stop it. Stop it. All right, I'm going to get on the bike and ride. And I'll let you know what I think when I'm done. <laughs> All right, guys, first impressions, I'm giving this thing five stars. They nailed this stuff from application all the way to utilization. I think that they got this stuff right on the money. I'm actually very impressed. So uh, I put this on about five minutes before my ride. I did an hour and 15 minutes with a 15 minute warm up, 45 minutes of a race on the bike and a 15 minute cool down. Put away all my stuff behind me uh, for the trainer. So it's been on for probably close to two hours and I still feel the potency of that kind of cooling from the menthol that I did when I first put it on. So that's gonna be really great in terms of hot weather rides or even when heat starts to build up on the indoor trainer for longer trainer rides. I think this stuff is going to be gold in conjunction with that CBD that's going to help with sensitive skin and those people who might be more prone to chafing or even saddle sores. So I, I've got to use this more long term, but I can already tell that this stuff's going to work really well. You know, it, it smells nice. It, it just, it seems to work well. It's very apparent that this is going to work. My only criticism of this, and I understand why it's not so much throwing a shot as it, it just is what it is, is the price. You know, this is a four ounce container here. This runs about $35. The eight ounce container runs about $60. So that's a lot of money for a little container of chamois cream. If you compare it to something like the chamois butter or other similar products that, that are at high end $18 for like an eight ounce container, it's more than twice as much for half the volume. That being said, a little bit goes a long way in 
terms of application here. You don't need to use as much. This is like a perfect blend between the Asos that goes in a little bit firm and sometimes a little clumpy, and then something like the chamois butter here, which can be really extra creamy and can kind of get messy. You don't need very much. This stuff absorbs into the skin pretty readily, so the application is a much better experience, and you don't have as much waste, so you don't need to use that much in the hand to get this stuff to work. It's definitely going to be worth the price if you suffer from excess chafing or from saddle sores. You're better off investing and being able to go on your long rides than suffering and trying to use a cheaper product that just doesn't work for you. But for the rest of this week, they're running a promotion. It's the same promotion I use. I don't, this isn't gonna be an affiliate link or anything like that. It's just something to help you guys out if you're interested. So they're running 25% off any of the products. And then if you purchase some of the chamois cream, they threw in this uh, muscle rub, I think. Uh, yeah, like a muscle butter. So for sore muscles, kind of, I don't know, like maybe something akin to like a Tiger Balm or something like that. So you get 25% off. I think I got up close to $9 off of this stuff and then they threw this stuff in for free. Uh, we'll crack this stuff open right here and just kind of give you an idea. I haven't used this yet, actually. So same kind of menthol. This actually smells much like the Lactigo, probably the CBD equivalent of the Lactigo. Um, it's kind of like a loose, kind of a gel cream. So I'll give this a try maybe after a gym day. Kind of goes on nice. Looks like it absorbs in the skin pretty well. Um, not super greasy or anything like that. I can say the same thing for the application of the uh, this chamois cream. Not super greasy, doesn't stay greasy on the hands. I would always recommend washing your hands, obviously, after you apply it, but it doesn't like leave a greasy film or anything like that, which could be really gross with some of these creams and gels and salves and whatnot. But bottom line is I would recommend it. If you have the budget for it, if you suffer from any type of excess chafing or any type of saddle sores or just some discomfort in the saddle it, it's definitely worth a try you know again the additional expense but you're definitely not getting uh, any kind of snake oil here this stuff works pretty well and with the discount if you get it i don't know when it ends i'm assuming it ends on saturday it was supposed to end on halloween but they extended it for a week i saw it on their twitter uh, account so i'm going to share a coupon code i'll try to find as many as i can i know of one off the top of my head right now so i'll share that in the show notes so that you guys can use it so today is currently the tuesday the third so hopefully by the end of this week if you want this you can get your order in with that discount code save yourself 25 percent get yourself a free little container of the muscle rub here and hope that if you guys are interested that you guys enjoy it but at any rate if you don't mind hitting that thumbs up button if you found this helpful subscribe if you haven't already thank you guys so much for making it to the end of the video and as always i will catch you in the next one see ya